I have 10,000 hours in Rust. I've never touched grass. And many of those hours are whilst playing solo. And today, I'm going to be putting those hours to the test. Whilst playing on full pop, official Rust, clan, vanilla servers. To start my day off, I instantly ran to the snow. It was a Friday morning, so the day after went, making things for me a little bit easier. Such as finding raided bases with some freebies for a grub like me. And as always, the snow stays winning. Snow is home. So I put the starter for my brand new solo base in a pop populated clan area, hoping to see some decent action. Also, by the time this video goes up, I will have surpassed 200,000 subscribers, which is... It's definitely something. <laughs> I appreciate all the love and support. Let me know as well if you want to see a base build tutorial for my new base I'm building in this video. I found out pretty quick that there were already some snow roamers in my location, which was good. So I continued building my starter base. And then I came across a raided base with a box, which must have been missed. What the hell? I mean, I'm not complaining, bro. So I quickly yoinked all that and made another starter base to store all the wood. See, it was early morning around 5am UK time, so what is about to happen I didn't expect. What? The server's about to restart, and that base just got MLRS. Once the server booted back up after the scheduled restart, I headed straight to the compound I was going to get raided. And it seemed like I was somehow the first to get there because it was eerily quiet. Dude. Oh my god. Oh my god, bro. I headed straight back, but now the raiders got a little bit active. Holy shit, that timing, bro. Get me out of there, man. Oh. Oh my god, they're raiding at a different base, I think, now. Or, or the same base again? There's no way. There is no way. Yes, finally, sewing kits. Give me some cloth, please. More bags. It felt really good getting some more cloth on my hands because the whole time I only had one bag, but now I have five. Five respawns, five chances to grub. And it was becoming clearer and clearer that this raid was definitely grubbable. It seemed as well that the defenders had actually woken up as well. This was about to be war, and I just found myself a DB. But I had to make my move before the raiders started to really rock it. That's not bad at all. That is not bad at all. Kill's broken, but hey man. Cannot complain about a free AK just like that. Spawn in, get a DB, boom, 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 bing, bing, bang. Free AK. I did put the AK at my base and went back, but at this point, there were lots and lots of other grubs here. And also the raiders were now here in full effect. That's their base. Bro, that's their like raid base thing? That tiny shack? Fourth round of MLRS. The fourth round of MLRS. Now they start rocketing. Dude, are you dumb? So brain dead, man. Whilst I grew up this raid, I'd like to thank you guys and girls for passing the 6k like goal on my last video. Every single time I set a goal for likes, you guys just destroy it. So do we think we can hit a goal of 10k likes for this video? These raiders were ruthless. They would not stop raiding, plowing the space. But soon, Nighttime fell, and what better time for me to get inside than under the cover of the night? The art of grubbing is genuinely like so hard to do. <laughs> I'm gonna die of cold before I get to base, but at least I got an AK out of it. But this group has used so many rockets on this base already, like, I don't get it. <laughs> what more is there to be had? What more loot is there, bro? They've blown so much. 
four rounds of MLRS, a bunch of like regular rockets. This base has been plowed and they're still here, they're still raiding. So much time has passed. No way, bro. And I get ratted for everything just like that. As frustrating as this was, it is what it is. There were still some leftovers, so I ran back and took what I could. Then I went back to the raid and managed to snag myself a Thompson. Then, on my way back home with it, I came across a raided base with a tier 2 inside of it, but the TC was locked. I needed this tier 2 workbench. Taking the tier 2 would require me to make a lot of noise, so before making myself too known to my area, I farmed a bit and expanded my solo base, and then I got to work crafting the handmade shells and raiding the TC. Honestly man, this is why I love like playing these weekly servers like two days late, because like these bases, they do all the hard work for me. It's perfect. It's literally perfect. Bro, mixing table? Wait, did I get raided? Wait, oh, someone raided this base. Already. It's raided. Like, recently. They raided my flank base. Uh, where are they going, man? Wait, where are they going, bro? Please. I haven't got- Bro, are they- I'm, I'm getting raided, I think. I'm getting raided. I'm actually getting raided. They're crouching up right now. Hello, bro. I boom, boom, you. We don't raid you, bro. I don't trust that we shit, bro. We don't raid you. This might just be their farm base. This might just be a farm base. But like, why are they doing it so close to me, bro? But they're like running at my base, though. That's just weird. Okay. Like, what is going on, bro? If they were raiding, I had to be very, very careful. These two meds is all I have, and I had no cloth to make more. So I could not get hit. I think they're trying to use the quarry. Who are you shooting at, little bro? Oh, Jesus. One might be still totally camping me, I'm not sure. After a quick scrap heli scare, it knocked some sense into me. I was not prepared to defend my base if I did get raided. So I set out to acquire more gear and try and find myself some cloth. Since I literally only had three cloth in my TC for like five hours that day. But as always with these kind of things, there's way too many distractions, bro. God, bro, suck a dick. Oh. And that false crap is here again. Oh my god. Awesome. Oh my god, bro. I'm so, I can't even leave my own base now. Are you ready for he just doesn't miss. One dead. <laughs> Ouch. Oh. No.
Yeah, he's right here. <laughs> the pre-fired nade. Always works. Trying to get cloth in my area was next to impossible, with every base having a roof camper or a grub next to it. Jesus Christ, barricade. Bro. Look at this shit, I'm getting roof cam from two different roofs! Like I said once, what's crazy to me is that both of these guys clearly have guns, but they just won't bring them out. But there goes like a lot of my cloth already. Did he just kill himself? Bro, you are dumb as bricks. These are the kind of players that his roof camp with SARS and bring out crossbows, like this guy. This is why. This is also why they'll never improve. That's crazy. I spawned elsewhere and wanted to see if I could get another star someplace else. Hopefully in a place with more cloth and less roof campers. Well, I was like, okay, this CPU is Okay. Yo, did you loot my bow? I think you killed me earlier, bro. With MP5, right? I'm just- I'm homeless. You know where I died? Or is it looted? Do you loot my bow? They definitely just, just like, sprayed me off their roof or something. What the heck? They raided my base. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Are you kidding me? Hey, let me save you the trouble, bro. There's nothing in there, man. That- This is my home. Oh, man. I- I just built this. Oh, if you wanted loot, you could have just asked. I ain't got shit in here, bro. I. He's still. I. I mean, sure. This lit. I'm broke, bro. You gonna take all my shit, really, bro? Really? Please. I need to get to my base. Go! No, bro. Oh my god, I'm getting every- I'm getting- Dude, this is so AIDS, man. Why did I build here? Everyone's on the roof. Yo, you are an actual loser, dude. Bro, I just wanted to play of a lifetime on those two fucking dickheads that raided my base and then you take it all, man. Come on, dog. Wait, are you a solo player as well? Oh, you're solo. Bro, I'm a solo as well, man. Why were you running in a group of three then, bro? I want- Dude, nah, nah, nah. They just raided my base. That was my base they were raiding. And then you killed one of them, I picked up the gun and killed the other one. Alright, alright, dude. Oh, this ain't you. Is this you? Oh, what the fuck? Fucking, fucking come on. What? I'm on the front of you. Yeah, I'm right here. Yeah. Go Yo, what the? Base, My G. All right, we got a friend, chat. We got a friend, bro. He did just roof cap me for like my guns that I just worked hard for, but he's giving me 2k frags. <gasps> Is he giving me the? Sh uh, I thought he was giving me the loot back. Yo, this guy's juicing me up. What the fuck? Wait, he is giving the. He's giving me meds. Wait, he's giving me the loot back. What a G, this guy. Hey, respect, bro. Yo, do you want to make a team? You want to make a little team, solo team, me and you? We don't want to roam together, but, you know, just, just so I don't kill each other. Uh, uh, yeah, I invite you. What a legend. Then, not long after this, a raid broke out. So, I tried to counter as a solo player. But it turns out my new ally came to help as well. Body, the body. Did a stone node. Did he loot it? Nice. Nah, no heals. I have one hard, one slow as well. Can you get me up? 
Endured it. Naz was repaid. He ran to his base to depot his extra guns, and I stayed at the raid. Why I'm naked? I just want a little bit of stuff, man. Oh my god, what a G! They open. The fuck? I have no 9 mil. Doing three times that guy. You have 9 mil? Naz had returned from his depot and he brought 9 millimeter and also meds because he knew I didn't have any. But then something tragic happened and once again I was alone. Oh f Nice, nice guys. Oh. No! And as for Naz, he never woke up. But for me, it wasn't over. I kept going. No, why did you do this? Why did you do this? Why did you do What's going on? Like no bullets. Literally zero bullets. Oh dude. I love the smell of like nighttime air, bro. Why does nighttime smell so good compared to daytime? Oh. I came across yet another raid, but there were bodies and people around me. In Rust, it is very important that you have a good awareness of your surroundings, as it can lead to a lot of things happening, both good and bad. How many people, man? Oh my god. I don't even know I was there. It's like five. What the fuck's name is Piebald? And the Delta DB. There was some decent action in this area. I just like recently raided. And I came across a raided base, which soon would be mine. Yet another home of mine on the map. Home? Maybe if this guy doesn't kill me over here, then would. Big roof. Only one! Hooah! GG. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This guy really was a brokey. I'm gonna pick him up. Welcome home, boys. Welcome home. Maybe. Oh. Oh man, this is like the remnants of the fight I just was involved in. Fucking depressing, man. Wait, a bunch of loot though. Maybe another gun here still? That is my AK, probably. Piebald. Wait, he died! They gotta kill me! They got killed! Hey, body bag. <gasps> we remain on foot. 
It ain't over till the fat lady sings, whatever the fucking quote is. <laughs> Bro's been on the drink a little bit too much. That guy's getting on a different planet right now. If we take those, that's uh extra gun. Um I'll just go with the uh the Tommy. Because the AK has no bullets really, and I'd rather, you know, be able to spray more than one clip. Just hopefully the base owners don't come back to their base. <laughs> They're not grief, so they could just walk back inside and take all my shit and leave. But honestly, that'd be pretty funny. I saw a small group of AKs roaming up the hill, so I followed them. What? I don't want to be like in the open towards that base. Where did this AK guy just go? If he lives in his base, then why is he just... Oh no! Okay, he is... Is this a good angle to hold? Yeah, we'll hold this. Oh, man. Oh, oh. Stop! Stop! Stop fight! Stop fight! Dude, dude. How did he not die to that, man? Did I get invalid? Invalid. I would assume they just took all my shit already, yeah? There's no way they just, like, left a gun by accident or some, or some shit like that. Maybe in some dimension they left, like, a 5-5 five five on a body. <laughs> Surely. <laughs> they actually did! <laughs> okay. I don't know why they didn't loot the body. I don't know how they didn't loot the body. I don't know how they missed the body. I don't know how they forgot about the body. Like, it's not like the 20 deep in the comms of AIDS. Like, there are three people, at least that I was fighting just then, and one guy just forgot to loot his body. Maybe they didn't live in that base then. Maybe they were just, like, fighting the guys in the base, and they didn't want to depot it or something. I don't know. Don't get me wrong, I'm not complaining, but that doesn't add up. I roamed with my AK at round launch. I don't think anyone's gonna be in launch. But then again, Brad's respawned and someone did take Brad not long ago. What the hell just happened? I just got firing squatted. All that running around is to get firing squatted by like a random trio. I'm not gonna catch him, I don't think, boys. It's not looking good. I never, never mind. He ran in front of me somehow. Was he really that scared to push me? Eventually, nighttime fell, and in this case, it was not in my favor. But then I heard a raid not far from my base and decided to go and check it out. Are they good at the game? No, not really. Not really. You think I can kill him with one mag? I think you can. I've only got one clip. All right. You bait, I'll kill them both. Just, just run at them now. Just go okay, okay. at them. It's my base. Oh, it's his base. We've got to save him. <laughs> Wait, literally... What a G. 